Oh wow, they are rushing us hard. Get away! Get away from me! Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Landon. Welcome back to Madden 18 Career Mode using Kirk Cousins. We're in week three of the NFL season playing against the 0-2 Tampa Bay Buccaneers. We're also 0-2, so we should be able to beat the Buccaneers. They're not the best team, so let's hop right in. Here we go. So somehow they turned the ball over twice, even though this is the first time I'm getting the ball. So it's first and 10 on the 40-yard line, 430 left in the first quarter. Let's see if we can do something here. Let's see if we can hit Stefan Diggs on the left side. Let's roll out a little bit. Oh, our B is wide open. Kyle Rudolph. Ooh, down to the 17, 16. Now, I did lose my save file from when I played the Steelers in last videos with Kirk Cousins, so I had to replay it, but we still lost the game. Tried to make our stats as, like, uh, as... I guess close as they could be. I couldn't get both the interceptions I got last video, but I did get one. So it's second and four. Let's go for the end zone. Eh, anybody going to get open? Oh, Kyle Rudolph actually wide open. Somebody, anybody should probably cover him. That's going to make it 7 nothing. Let's see if our defense can make another stop against Jameis Winston and the Buccaneers. So here we are at the beginning of the second corner. Second and six, seven and three us. I'm just not a big fan of what the Buccaneers have and go. Like, they have Jameis Winston, they have Mike Evans, but aside from that, they don't have, I guess, Cameron Bray too. But other than that, they don't really have anybody. So here we are, second and six. Let's try to get a first down right here. Oh, A's wide open. We're getting rushed hard, too, but a nice catch by Kyle Rudolph, and he's injured. Great. So here we are, third and four. So it does look like he got injured. For some reason, he's not in on this play, if, if he isn't injured. So let's try to get a first down, third and four. Somebody cut. Michael Floyd with the cut. Oh, that's Stefan Diggs, but he cannot hold on to the ball. Well done. First and 10, 430 left in the second quarter, 7-6. to six. They can only get field goals, so our defense is doing something. RB wide open. Oh, Kyle Rudolph is back in the game. Down to the 44, 42-yard line. I did used to be a fan of Doug Martin, but now he's on the Oakland Raiders, which is just strange because they got Marshawn Lynch and Doug Martin. It's just a, a weird combination, I guess is the best way to put it. But here we are, first and 10, 350 left in the second quarter. I'm going to try to hit Kyle Rudolph. He's going to cut to the right side. If he does, uh, right, wide open. Go, go, go. Oh, he's still on his feet. Get out, run him over. Wow, two guys had to stop him. Okay, what is that down to? The 33-yard line. Second and five, 238 left in the second quarter. We're in field goal range? I believe, yeah, definitely in field goal range. So we're at least going to get three points out of this drive. But I obviously aim it for that touchdown. Delvin Cook. Yes. What is that going to get him down to? The eight? The 13, okay, we're on the wrong side of the 10. First and 10, we just hit the two-minute warning. We are on the 13-yard line. We're going to try to hit Stefan Diggs because for some reason, four verticals seems like a good idea here. don't really understand the concept behind that. Actually, Kyle Rudolph, wide open. What? How did he not score a touchdown right there? Are you kidding me? How is that possible? Yeah, you better booth review that. His feet had to have been in. He was wide open. Yeah, there's one. Oh, okay, maybe. That's close. Can we get another angle? Those angles aren't helping me. I don't know if that that right foot doesn't help me whatsoever. Can we get a higher angle, maybe? Maybe? Nope. Here comes. Let's see what happens. I'm going to skip over it. Yes, they gave us the touchdown. Nice. This is going to be such an easy victory. They went three and out, so we have a minute 43 with all of our timeouts to score another touchdown, and then we get the ball at the halftime. So let's try to score right here and then get the ball back, score again, and then this video will pretty much be over. Oh, we're going to have to roll out. Ah! Ooh, okay, good. We got rid of it. That might have been a fumble, but I'm not going to say anything about it. I'm very lucky that wasn't a fumble, but here we are, second and 10. Four verticals play again. See if Kyle Rudolph can... Oh, wow! We just got sacked right there. They called the timeout. All right. That's weird, but all right. I mean, I guess they called the timeout so they can try to get the ball back and score. But here we are, third and 17. We're running this play. They said this play for some reason. I don't really understand the concept because Diggs doesn't even get by the line. I wish it was like in real life where they would definitely go across the line. No one's rushing us. Uh, oh, Stefan Diggs actually going to catch it for a big, big first down. We're going to have to call a timeout. Timeout. Thank you. First and 10, a minute 20 left in the half. I want to get at least a field goal, make it 17 to 6. But we have plenty of time where we could probably score a touchdown. No one's rushing us. X wide open. Yes. Stefan Diggs down to the 17 yard line. Nah, I don't know if we should call a timeout quite yet. Yeah, we're on the 17. No reason to. Oop. Okay, well, that's the same play, but. Why? 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 What is their obsession with this play? I don't understand. Oh, wow. They are rushing us hard. Get away! Get away from me! Yes! 
for the touchdown. Kirk Cousins for 17 yards. I thought they were going to catch up to me. I really, really did. But that is going to make it 21 to 6 going into halftime. So they didn't end up scoring. So it is 21 to 6 at the beginning of the third quarter. If we score a touchdown here, probably just going to run the rest of the game. I'm surprised they're not doing that quite yet. Maybe they just want to make sure it's definitely out of reach so we can get our first one of the season. But here we go. We're going to drop back. Uh, no. Ooh, wow. Ooh, wow. Still on our feet. Still on our feet. Fighting. Wow. Get rid of the ball. And then we end up getting sacked after all that. That sucks. Second and 10. That was, I thought we were going to get away, get a big play right there, but there was nobody open. So second and 10. I'm going to try to hit Adam. Th okay. Or we're going to get sacked. We're still on our feet. How is this possible? Uh, yeah, he was definitely out of bounds. Okay. They're just rushing right through the line on every single play. Third and 10. Hopefully they can make some blocks this time. Okay, we got time. We got some time. We don't get anybody open. And we got sacked again by Gerald McCoy. Wow. Good thing they can't do anything on offense whatsoever. It's still 21 to 6 with 430 left in the third quarter. This game is pretty much over, but I'm going to keep trying to get a first down, score some points. Treadwell. Yes, Treadwell. Woo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. What is that? 44-yard line, 43. First and 10, 345 left in the third quarter. See if somebody can get open. I'm gonna have to roll out a little bit. Okay, great. We have a holding penalty. So I'm just gonna, you know, run along the sideline and then slide because I think it's gonna send me back 10 yards from there. Clearly, I don't know football. So it's for, I guess if it's a holding penalty by one of the uh the guys while you're running, then it's back from wherever you end up. But since it was from the uh the line of scrimmage, now it's first and 20 on the 33 yard line, three and a half minutes left. Here we go. Anybody, anybody. Oh, Kyle Rudolph wide open. Is he going to be able to... Ooh, 54. I don't know exactly who 54 is, but that was a nice tackle right there. Third and three, a minute 45 left in the third quarter. We're doing this double slant, but also Rudolph's going out to the right. This actually isn't exactly the double slant play. Oh, Kyle Rudolph with a ton of separation. What a play by number 58. Wow. They legitimately can't get anything going. They just went three and out again. There is one minute left in the third quarter. First and 10. I mean, is the game over? Probably. Am I still going to try to score? Yes. Oh, wide open. Is that Adam? Oh, that's Kyler Rudolph again. And he's going to stay on his feet. Wow. How many people do they need to tackle him? His stats are crazy right now. So here we are, third and 13 on the 49-yard line, 450 left in the fourth quarter. Somebody just got hurt. I'm not sure who it was. We got Rudolph, Lloyd, Cook, Thielen in. I'm assuming that's Diggs on the left side. Try to get a first down here. Put the game away. Oh, there's Michael Floyd with the huge catch. The huge, huge catch. That puts us in the field goal range. We Obviously, the game's pretty much over as is. They want us to run it? Really? I guess that makes sense, but I don't want Dalvin Cook to get injured. But it's first and 10 and 419 left in the game. I'm just going to bring you guys along for this one so I don't just do a weird, awkward cut. It just said Coleman was on either the page. Oh, no, because this is realistic rosters. What? First and 10 on the 16-yard line. 2.30 left in the game. The game is all but over. But since we're probably going to score a touchdown here, they want us to pass for some reason on first and 10. We're going to go for the end zone. Oh, are we going to get sacked? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Get rid of the ball to Stefan Diggs for the... No? No. He didn't get in? How is that possible? I don't really understand this. I picked the play the coach wants me to do, and it's second and goal on the one-yard line. They just used the timeout. And they want me to pass the ball for whatever reason. I mean, I'm going to do it, obviously. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Adam Thielen for the touchdown. I'll see you guys in a second at the stat screen. That's going to make it 28-6. to six, And that's probably what the final score is going to be. So I guess I was wrong. They did score a touchdown. So we won 28-14. to 14, But let's check out the stats before we end this video. Kirk Cousins, 15-19, 294. Three touchdowns. I believe also had a rushing touchdown, if I remember correctly. Jameis Winston, 11 for 22, 128 with a touchdown. I mean, that's not terrible. It's not very good either. Who is, isn't that the kicker? That is the kicker. Why did he throw a pass? The hell happened? Dalvin Cook, 13 rushes, 41 yards. Chris, or Charles Sims, rather, 13 rushes, 42 yards. Kirk Cousins, 5 for 13 with a touchdown. Kyle Rudolph, eight catches, 156, two touchdowns. Stefan Diggs, three for 80. Uh, Adam Humphreys, three for 61. Really? Deshaun Jackson went two for seven. Cameron Bray, two for 32. Anybody else there anything to talk about down here? Not really. Mike Evans, one for three with a touchdown. He had one ball thrown to him. That's crazy. But that is going to be it for this video. If you liked the video, give it a like down below. Make sure to check out my channel. Subscribe for daily Madden 18 content. And I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.